So today we did get uh, information and notes about a uh, ongoing cruelty investigation for possible physical abuse and torture. Um, at this moment, our department and El Paso Police Cruelty Unit can assure the dog has been uh, removed and is safe in a new location. Although he is not available for adoption at this time, uh, there is hundreds of other dogs available um, at the rescue for a second opportunity as well. I know a lot of people decide to remain anonymous in cases, and although it's encouraged, we also encourage them to speak up. It could be to no leads, unfortunately. If we do not know or have any substantial um, evidence, then we can't proceed uh, with anything legally. Um, so if you do see something, go ahead and call 311 and let us know um, if they decide to remain anonymous, um, at least provide a phone number. And that way, our department or any other department can reach out to them to acquire any evidence that is going to make this case only stronger uh, for the animals or animal involved. But cooperate with our department and any other department that reaches out. They are our lifeline companions. They are part of our family. Um, they cannot express much of their pain or concern, um, so we are the voice for them. If you see something, say something, call 311, and that way we can go ahead and investigate accordingly. Um, you are the voice for our voiceless, uh, so let's go ahead and speak up for them. Thank you so much for watching this Feel Friday, and we'll see you again next week.